Good morning, students. I hope you all are fine today. And let us continue with our algebra class. Today we will do exercise eleven C. All of you turn to page number two hundred and twelve. Okay, page two hundred and twelve. Exercise eleven C. Now I have written down the first question for you all. Now in this one we just have some uh, variables. As you know, the variables, all the letters in the alphabet, starting from A, B, C, right down till X, Y, and Z. So here also we have some variables marked as X and Y and Z. Okay, X value is assigned. X is equals to five, Y equals to six, and Z equals to ten. So we have to find the value of this particular algebraic expression. Okay, this is an algebraic expression. Three Z divided by X. This can even be written as three into Z divided by X. You know, if nothing. No sign is there between a number or a variable, or even any two variables also. If no sign, it is assumed that there is multiplication sign. So three z means three into z. Now all we have to do is put z equals to ten and x equals to five. Right from here, the question. The question also says z is ten, so we will put z ten. So let's see what we get. So we will have three into z. That is ten. So three into ten divided by x divided by five. I will. I hope you have understood. What I have done is I have just put the values of the variables z and x. Z is ten. X is five. So three into z means three into ten divided by x means divided by five. So next step we have to simplify this. We can cancel five and ten. Five and five. Five two is ten. So you will have three into two divided by one. That is six divided by one. Which is equal to six only. So the answer of this particular expression is six. Okay. I think we have understood this. It is as simple as it is. Then we have uh, another one, part two. In this we have x y divided by z. X y divided by z. So again, no multiplication. I mean, there is no sign between x and y. So we will have to write x into y. No sign means multiplication sign is there. Okay. Once again, I am saying x y. There is no sign between x and y. So there is multiplication sign. So now put what are the values of x? Same again, x is y. Y is six. Z is ten. So we will get x into y will be five into six divided by z. That is ten divided by ten. Okay, I hope you understand this. Then you can do the calculation. Five into five. Five two is ten. Again, two one to two. Two three is six. So what do we have remaining? One into three divided by one. That is three divided by one. That is three itself. So the answer 